What is going on guys, DBG here, and today we are going to be talking about NBA 2K23, my team lads. So, I'm out here looking at, um, I'm out here looking at 2K TV. This is, my this is probably going to be a locker code, by the way. Uh, this is either going to be an easy challenge or probably a locker code. But lads, 2K just dropped, this, like, I'll have a different thumbnail. If this is a free challenge and it's easy, I'll have one thing. And if this is a, like, locker code, I'll have another thing. But 2K just dropped a bunch of free content and no one gives a damn. First of all, yesterday we have Robert Covington. No one gives a damn, man. No one gave a damn. Roko, had you not, had they not banned half the player base, everyone would be hyped for Roko. Because he's good, man. He's really good. Roko on normal. Okay. Decent release. Not great. Decent. The guy moves. The guy is like, he's got a shot. He's got decent speed to ball acceleration. He's got very good defense and an unbelievable player build and can play the two. Like, let's not forget, like, in NBA 2K22, we were hyping up this dude. Like, I'm pretty sure I ran him in my squad first stage and Ty was running for a while. We had it, got him on the 5th of May. Yes, he had 12 Hall of Fame badges. Like, you're looking at total stats. You're looking at, like, 2866 versus... 2A44. Like, stats-wise, he was better last year. He was better this year than last year. He did also have a release on uh, very quick last year, which does help. And uh, a better dribble style. But still, I was running this guy. And, like, we were a hype type. You, you guys can even see this right here. 71 comments on this card. 71. 9. 9. Nobody cares. Nobody cares, man. They actually like, and it's actually scary. Like I saw a tweet from JD crossover. Like, I don't think they realize that how few people there are that that are not banned and put money into this game, which is mad because so few people buy. It, it actually, by the looks of things, it actually seems like most packs are bought with empty. It actually seems like most packs are bought with empty because JD tweeted, like, Yao is going to be extinct. In four hours time, Yao might be extinct. And Yao's gone up in price. Tatum could be extinct soon. And like Kareem could be extinct. Which is kind of nuts. But um, yeah. Um, anyway, we got Roko. Roko's really good. Again, when you get unbanned, Roko's pretty good. Then we got Kevin Martin today. So Kevin Martin has got Kevin Martin on normal. Like, are they really giving us Kevin Martin on normal timing? When we... Why not just make it quick? You give everyone yesterday a quick release. Like, I'm, I'm pretty sure, if I'm not mistaken, is Miles Turner is, and Rudy Gobert. And they're the only two guys with normal timing in this whole thing. Obviously, you've got slow. You've got guys like Jamal Murray on slow. You've got um, a couple of guys on slow. I'm pretty sure everyone else is a release on quick. Including Hunter, who's got a slow-ass release. He's on quick. They go and give him... They go and make him a card. So... They give him a 93 three ball, amped catch and shoot, corner special, medium edition, volume shooter, range extender. He's got the pro two leaner. Like this card legitimately sucks. I do want to say this, like this card legitimately sucks. It's hard to do anything with him. He, like he doesn't do anything. But at the same time, like if he's a free locker code card, I can't really, um, I can't really like say too much bad about him if he's a free locker code card at the end of the day. Because having a free locker code card, like, that's all you can read. That's all you can really ask for. But, um, yeah, it's, it's a madness. It is a madness. It's a mad old thing where I'm looking and I'm just like, this is one comment. This is one comment. Still no Pelicans takeover. This is one comment. This has been up 15 minutes. This is one comment. One. 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 And I'm like, I'm genuinely like, like so torn. I'm going to make a video on this later because I simultaneously think that MT selling is terrible for my team. I think it's terrible for my team. Like I think genuinely it's terrible. These companies are, let's just say dodgy. Let's just say they are quite dodgy. Um, I think it is, it ruins the market at times. But at the same time, cards aren't going down in price that much. 
Because like there's just it's a supply and demand and getting rid of the empty getting rid of everyone who bought empty ruins the supply. But um that's another story because pack odds are so bad. But like I I think it's hor it's a horrible thing for the game mode, but like they've gotta it was the wrong time. Like when you see maybe maybe this is the logic of 2K where it's like, look, nobody's playing this game anyway. This game's dead anyway. We can't kill the game even more. Like, even Olo Kanu, only 14 comments. If this was any other year, he would be legitimately, like, one of the most hyped of players. Kevin Garnett, only less comments than Roko last year. But, like, I think if this was any other year, they would have said, look, we don't want to kill our player base. Things are going good. And I think from their perspective, maybe they're saying, oh, things are going so bad. It doesn't really matter if we make it worse. But, um, yeah. Anyway, so we are going to be talking about this. Nobody gives a damn. 2K have um, brought out the content. Nobody gives a damn. Nobody gave a damn about Roko yesterday. And then we have Spotlight Sims, and there was a stage yesterday where there was not a single My Team streamer on. 2K can give us all the best content they want. Nobody gives a damn right now. And it's it's scary. It's scary. Like, again, I don't know. Um, I don't know uh, whether or not my account is banned. I'm going through my Schrodinger's ban, ex ban experiment, as in, I'm not looking, I'm not booting up my Xbox. So until I boot up my Xbox, my account is both banned and not banned. So I will never know. Funny thing is, is that I'll boot it up in 10 days and then I don't know if it'll be a 10 day or a 30 day. <laughs> Either way, it doesn't really matter. My account is both banned and not banned. But um, yeah, so that is pretty much it, lads. What do you guys think? Are you guys excited about Kenny Marks? I couldn't give a damn. I actually couldn't give a damn. He's going to be a locker code. We got Roko. Like I'm, I'm currently trying to beat these hell challenges with my golds. And for anyone who's, for anyone who is saying like, oh, these aren't that bad, dude. Try to beat Kareem, Magic, and freaking Worthy without Magic getting five, getting five assists. Or not even that. Try to beat uh, Sean Elliott, David Robinson, and Tim Duncan without getting blocked. While with gold, um, freaking JaVale McGee, gold Dwight Powell, and gold JJ Barea scoring 40 points. It's not easy. I need the, I need the green eight threes in a row with JJ Barea to win that game. Eight fadeaway threes with JJ Barea and not get blocked. I've had two, I've heard, I've like set that challenge to like guy 250 qualifiers and they can't do it. It is the most hell thing ever if you're normally spending. You need like 200k to get the guys with this. Otherwise it's hell. But, um, yeah, so 2K dropped the best grind yesterday. They're prob we're probably getting a free locker code today. And they dropped a good-ass Tuesday takeover card. And nobody cares. Nobody cares. It's kind of sad. 